Well, we always try to beat the heat in West Texas, but popular sunscreen brands have some recalls because of a cancerous chemical that was found in them. So now you're probably wondering, well, what kind of sunscreen should I use? So do I have to bust out the aloe vera and make my <laughs> own or what should people be looking out for? And honestly, that's what I was saying. It's just a surprise and a shock that it's brands that we're using all the time. Now, I had the chance to speak with Dr. Atkins at Midland Dermatology about this sunscreen recall, and he doesn't want people to stop using sunscreen, but instead preferably stay away from the spray and aerosol sunscreens because they are the ones that are carrying benzene, a cancerous chemical. The summer heat isn't going anywhere anytime soon. And to stay protected, we need to continue using our sunscreens. But now it seems we'll have to start taking a closer look before applying it. Johnson & Johnson recently recalled some sunscreens because a cancerous chemical called benzene was detected in them. So benzene is a, is a hydrocarbon product similar to gasoline or oil. It's in, envir in, a, in our environment. It's found in, in many different locations and places. Uh, benzene is a cancer-causing ingredient um, and is thought to be linked to blood can cancers uh, in particular. A study was conducted on various brands of sunscreens by an independent lab, Verlisher, where more levels of benzene were detected. During the recall, they tested a total of 294 um, products, and about 80 of those products tested positive um, for for benzene. And as a result, the chemical ended up being found in more aerosol spray sunscreens instead of cream based. The vast majority of those products are either off label, what I would consider to be generic products, which are not from a mainstream national um, large producer, um, or aerosol products, which are the spray products. Dermatologists like Dr. Atkin at Midland Dermatology do suggest sticking to the lotion-based sunscreens for now. I think the lotions and creams for the time being um, are safer. Um, I think the chemical, I would personally stay away from the chemical-based sunscreens and opt more for um, the mineral-based sunscreens. Now, if you do have any of these recalled sunscreens, you should dispose of them immediately. Now, I will have the list of these recalled sunscreens on this story on NewsWest9.com.